Hi, I'm Adam Smoleski with Hager. I'm here to give you a brief demonstration of the 824 window touch hardware insertion machine. This is an 8 ton machine with a 24 inch throat equipped with one modular auto feed system, a Windows touch screen control, a turret insertion system. The turret insertion system gives us four different lower tools which helps us incorporate single part handling. We can insert up to four different pieces of hardware four different styles into the same part in one handling. We've got set up one set of automatic tooling on our auto feed system so we can auto feed whatever faster we have the highest volume of and manually insert the balance. The turret is color coded to match the bins which is color coded to match the screen. You'll get a digital picture of your part on the screen so the operator knows which way to hold it as well as an insertion map showing the operator what hole to put what piece of hardware into. The computer will change the pressure from station to station to make sure that you get the right pressure for the right fastener in the right hole. I'll turn the machine on now, do a quick demonstration, shut the machine back off and go through the programming. As you can see, we're able to insert four totally different styles of hardware in a single part handling. 632 standoffs, M4 studs, M3 studs, and M3 nuts. So write the programs on the 824 window touch. It's a pretty simple process. Go to the program screen. Name your new program. and then fill in the blanks. The first thing you need to tell the computer is what type of fastener you're putting into your part. Select fastener type, select the style, whether it be a nut, a stud, or a standoff. Select the diameter, and select the proper length. Tell it what material you're putting it into, and we'll preset the pressure accordingly. Select the fastener, and then it'll ask for a style of tooling. In this case, we auto-fed standoffs in the first run. So we'll select multi-tool, which is automatic tooling for our multi-shuttle platform. When you select the multi-tool, it'll tell you what upper tool to put on the machine, what lower tool to put on the machine, what shuttle module, what orientation, and what simulation. Once you've filled in those blanks, you need to teach the computer where you're putting that hardware and how many. We write a new sequence. We tell it six pieces and create a map to show where those fasteners go into. Select an image from pictures that are already on the hard drive, or you can retrieve an image from the floppy disk, tie this into the network, take a picture with the digital camera, and retrieve those images. Find the image you want, and then make a map. Select location for fastener one of six. Two, three, four, five, and six. The programming is the same for station two, three, and four. Fill in the blanks, select the right hardware, create your map. Patented on all the Hagers is our safety system. We run low voltage through the tooling, ramp comes down and meets a non-conductive material, ramp comes back up. That's it for the brief demonstration. If you have any questions, please contact your local Hager representative or visit our website at hager.com. Thank you.